Hi, I'm going to show you the um, position of the camshaft solenoid oil valve for for the variable valve timing on this car. This is the G4 FA engine, the Hyundai i30. Um, so I'll show you where it is on, on the car. Basically, um, if we come out a little bit, there's your dipstick. And if we go in, I put my finger on it there, that's the connector for it. And uh, the valves in there, so if we get um, the light on it, go in. There you go. So the connector with the yellow dot on there, yellow mark, connects to that valve, and that's for your variable valve timing. Uh, it's a solenoid uh, controlled by oil, oil uh, pressure uh, when the car's under load. It'll change your variable valve timing. So that's the location of the uh, solenoid. Let's come out a bit. So there you go. This is what a camshaft phaser solenoid oil valve uh, looks like for your variable cam timing. I'll show you the side of it. Okay. Also, there's another one here. Uh, we can go in and look closely at it. Ok so that will give you an idea of what the part actually looks like. I found a technical service bulletin about uh, inspecting one of these control valves so it could be interesting to people. Um, these are the codes, DTC codes that you may get um, if the suspects relating to it, trouble codes. Um, so basically it tells you uh, what to do. Um, so if we scroll down uh, one of the checks is to te test um, the coils on there, so you can check um, check how much resistance uh, you get um, on the coils there. So that seems uh, a simple enough test to check. And obviously, if you get open circuit, uh, you have to replace um, or a short circuit. The same, but it's faulty. And also, um, you can um, test one of these by putting 12 volts across it, and uh, basically, it shows the uh, valve opening and closing. Um, so you can reverse the um, polarity, pl um, reverse the plus and minus uh, to make it switch backwards and forwards. Um, so there, if there's any debris in there, um, you can examine that, and remove it. So it's just a little test for anyone that wanted to um, to test one. Uh, there's some um, information out there how to do that. I hope that's useful and helpful to anyone.